We're gonna play some Clue today. Um, we're gonna have so much fun. I'm pretty good at it, I would say. I'm not quite sure my way, my webcam is not, still not wanting to cooperate with me today. Now we have it. We've got my webcam working. We're gonna play some Clue and we're just gonna get right into it. Gonna get the sound back on here. TV slash pink elephant gaming again we're gonna play some clue today it'll be so much fun all right we're gonna play online we're gonna have six people we're gonna go to the two-door mansion because I'm not too fine this season pass yet I'm like to be scarlet so I'm gonna click we've got Mrs. White was Reverend Green, and then there was this whole if issue. So now it's just green. I'm not quite sure. And then Mrs. Peacock, Professor Plum, potentially somebody else. I'm gonna get started. Figure out who done the murder. cards are in the envelope and in order to do so you go to a room whichever room that you choose and you make an, a guess with a person and a weapon then it goes to the next person so she's making a guess it'll go to this person if this person has one of those cards she will reveal one of those cards if she doesn't it'll skip her mark X's on the board where her cards, because we do not, because we know that she does not have any of those cards, and go to the next person until someone reveals a card. And if nobody reveals a card, it's very telling about what the cards are. So she asked about green, rope, and the hall. So I marked a one in Orchid's character spot under green rope and hall because we know that she has one of those three cards and over time the other cards will hopefully have X's over them which will narrow down which of the three cards that she has. So now it is Orchid's turn. I will probably guess white because she's the next person so I'll probably guess white with a weapon that hasn't been guessed yet okay. 
it's smart to bring your um, next person um, with you, this top person with you, into a room because then they have a chance of being in a room, A, and then when they make it a guess, it'll have to go through all these other people. So you'll be bound to get more information when they actually are able to make a guess. cards and any of the other cards and so showing one of those cards isn't necessarily going to nail down everything for somebody. I only have ballroom anyways out of those three options. Now I hit continue. Yeah, so I'll ask about like white with the revolver and then whichever room I can get into. But yeah, see how he pulled me into this room. So like at bare minimum, I can stay in the ballroom if I get a low roll. Which yes, won't give me a location card, but it'll help narrow down other cards. A five. I like to go into secret passage rooms first. So the kitchen. It shall be with white and the revolver suggests so she has one of those cards and now I'm gonna be shown that card does white have the white card revolver that's nice at least I know one out of the six Every time that you're that someone's in a room when they make a guess about a person, it immediately gasps. Like everyone gasps at once. That's like the audio that we get. Like, <gasps> not me. This is nice because I should get some useful information out of this. So now we know that green has either scarlet or pipe because I have ballroom.
So he's asking about Scarlet and the lead pipe, which is very interesting because we know that he has one of those two. And then she's giving him a card. Well, she's already has something on her haul, so it really could be Paul, or she could have one of the other two. She could have green and scarlet, and not the haul at all. Or she could just simply have the haul. <laughs> or she could have the haul and scarlet. one of the other ones. So it's not Scarlet and Lead Pipe. It could be Scarlet and not Lead Pipe. And like Rope or something. I'm gonna guess about something entirely different. Orchid, French. I don't like to re-guess my weapons and people. I don't like to re-guess unless I have to. Plum card, that would be nice. My cats are being a little chaotic today. Oh, well. Thanks for avoiding my plum card. <laughs> so now he knows two out of three of my cards and she knows one out of three and I think somebody else knows them already.
吗？It's not four out of the rooms, which is pretty good, honestly. But I still have no clue who the person or the weapon is. I have... Yeah. That's not good at all. But it'll be nice to slowly wean these down as well. I'm waiting on these two to hit continue. Finishing. Oh, he hit continue and I'm waiting on her to hit continue. There we go. Alright, now it's Mrs. White's turn. Who is she going to guess? I'm not obsessing over Scarlet and Lead Pipe because I know one of those is definitely wrong, and the other one, this Orchid character, could be also wrong. So they both could be wrong. And I don't like to. Yeah, no, no, thank you. You know, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. So this green character has either, not plum because I have plum, rope, or billiard room. So that's nice. On green I have two 50-50s is what I say. Oh, I see. I was like, what is on my floor? I have nothing on my floor. I was obsessing over it. It's not on my floor. It's on my desk. telling about Orchid. Either she really has Orchid card or she does not. I'm gonna get away my diving room.
Mighty Ho. It could be Wrench too. I don't think, I think she's really onto something. I think one of those is really the true thing. If not both. Ballroom. 
Well, I have to call her. So, maybe she'll ask about working in French, and I will know at least that, for sure, that Peacock has a news coming soon. Scarlet. Well, this is actually very telling information. First of all, we'll mark a five under Scarlet and Rope. Okay, continue. I should probably just have this rope. But, anyways. This is telling because now we know that for sure that he has the lead pipe. And we know for sure that he has the billiard room. Because there was a one here and a one here, and he showed one of those cards, but he obviously couldn't show Scarlet card, so he showed the lead pipe card. Same goes for rope and billiard room. So that just gave me a whole lot of information. And yes, I know for sure that uh, my notes are horrible on this person, and I totally get it. Like, all we know for sure is now it's down to a 50 50 between Scarlet and Hall that she has. <gasps> kitchen, lounge, or study. I think it's probably the lounge, honestly. That'd be very interesting. person has an answer about about things then we know that she doesn't have we know for sure what that she has scarlet but we shall see if she does answer then I'm running out of numbers and I don't know green wrench awesome this actually narrowed down quite a bit for me so first of all this last guy either has or the hall. But this narrowed down a lot because, okay, let's start with the ones. So there's a one here, a one here, and a one here. So she definitely has this one. Then we'll go to our twos. So two here, two here, two here. So this is definitely the two. Then we'll go to the threes. The threes cannot be marked off, but we knew that because that wasn't a repetitive thing. And then the fours, this is probably the four. And the fives, she had to Final Let's move on to another game, and welcome! We're gonna 
play online with six people, that's what I prefer. Scarlet card stolen right out from underneath me. Billiard room library. Oh, that's gonna be interesting. Oh, look, look at this boy. All he wants is attention. Yeah. Poor guy. So, um, 
anytime anybody makes a guess, I mark a one. Or anybody, if anybody gives um, a clue card, I mark a one under each column or each row that they mark the clue card in because I know that eventually over time there'll be X's over the other ones or I'll be able to deduce over time. And so it'll be helpful to know. Was it I? With the dagger? Nope. <laughs> what do you got? Oh, not to study. So that's nice. So like right in here. She should have one out of these three cards. But now that I have the study card, I know that she only showed either white or wrench. And maybe over time, maybe wrench will be X now. Somebody will ask about wrench and she might not have wrench. So then I will know for sure that she has the white card. So, it's a big spag on this, the uh, clue game. But it's really fun. I find it really relaxing. Just low-key, chill. If you have any, sorry. If you have any questions, you can always just let me know. In the kitchen. With green and the rope. Funk. Bonk. So she has one out of those three cards. there's more rooms than uh, weapons and people to show. So.
ask about the scarlet or plum. I'll ask about the candlestick and then one of those and then whichever room I can get into. She potentially has it. Potentially. Orchid or Hall. <laughs> she was just so much fun. She didn't want to know an entire category. I'm sorry, am I missing something? Am I missing something today? I, I'm not quite too sure. for sure that this person here wanted the pop. Why would you? She doesn't know any. She, no one's been in the dining room. something? Is she gonna get this right? Like, what am I supposed to be getting here? I'm only putting an explanation mark and not a check mark there because she was so dumb to make that final accusation right then and there that I I don't want to just get a, put a check mark based off of her idiocy. Idiocy. Based off of her being an idiot. Well, this freaking sucks because people are gonna know for sure what I have now. Because I didn't have plum revolver study. Or, er, well, she was in the. don't have, like, yeah, it's so frustrating. Anywho, I try not to give away things to people, and some people just don't understand that. Dining room? Was that a good guess? We shall see. In no one's bed? Or I have no information? I'm sorry. She had two of those wrong, at least, if not three. But now I know it's between lounge, hall, conservatory, ballroom. 
A kitchen, but I think that's just a good card. Ballroom. One of the things I need to mark up a scarlet with a dagger. Hmm. Well, you don't have ballroom, so you probably have either scarlet or dagger. about green next. That is insane. Or white? I don't know. Like, I know a lot of rooms, but I have no idea on the weapon. Well, this would be interesting because I don't know the dining room. Dagger and wrench, and we just don't know. No information, like it's. But it does tell me that this person definitely has Scarlet, because it was 50 50 between Dagger and Scarlet, and now we have Scarlet and Ragdar. Clean up our notes here. Or maybe I shouldn't clean the notes. You guys can then see why I made that um, later on. But. So now we're 25% chance on person, 0% uh, chance on the freaking uh, weapon, and 25% chance on the room. and make them check marks than five and that's not good at all <laughs> like we're nowhere close that's why i was so confused that that person guessed earlier the hall interesting well i don't have a hall card let's see if this person doesn't have a hall card if it checks marks on them then i'll give them that Depending on the personal weapon. <gasps> oh. Anybody but Orchid. We obviously know that she has Orchid or Hall. That's so frustrating. I'm not even. 
that's like the same guess that somebody else made. It's literally the same guess that somebody else made. That is so frustrating. Why would you do that? So You get no external information. Like there's It'd be better here to get for you to guess maybe two out of three. And if it skips her, like if you guessed Orchid, maybe Revolver Conservatory, and it skipped her, then you know for sure that she has the hall, which is what I want to do. I do really, really want to go to the lounge though. Or conservatory. That'd be really good. I can't go anywhere. Nobody moved me. That sucks. I just lost a turn. Hopefully I can deduce some things before my next turn. I that's frustrating. Ballroom. Green. Candlestick. Well, we know what she has. Haha. <laughs> she doesn't have green. She doesn't have ballroom. One of her cards is probably a room card or that. Yay, I finally have one weapon marked off. One weapon. Like, <laughs> do I need to start using my peacock to get all the other weapons? But even then, I don't even know the person. Like, ugh, this, this game is just frustrating.
You left the chair, you went to the window, now your brother went up to the chair, and now you're mad because your brother's in the chair, not you. I do have uh, my chat open on my other screen, so if you guys do want to chat, I'm all ears. And make sure to follow if you haven't followed already. I'm trying to get up to 50 followers, and then we'll do a Jackbox party at 50 followers. That'll be fun. Okay, I'm gonna freaking me up at this point, so I'm not ashamed. 
kitchen. Oh, they guess kitchen. Whoops! I'll just avoid these other ones. Master and Wrench next time. Or I'm gonna guess one of my other ones and then figure out if, if, if it is Master. Probably not gonna make this final accusation. 
I'm worried that they're gonna figure it out very quickly at this mustard and French. My cat likes to bat mice under the door and then like try and so I can bring this person in a room with me. So then when they make a guess, I can try and figure things out. Well, first part told me that it was mustard. Second part, then they guessed the same exact freaking guess. So that gave me no information. start just marking down all the rooms that I can. Thank you. 
my guess on these top three rooms. into what I'm doing is the problem and it's just very hard to do in Clue. Especially I only had like zero IQ today, so that doesn't help. person has rope or is rope. But it's 50-50 between orchid and rope and I. It's like what what do I guess? I don't know. It's 
study. I, I have a gut feeling. you even show me a carton. I know what it is. I'm sorry. My bad. I really wanted it to be haul. But everything else, I, I could have gone into the study. If it's a study card, I'm going to feel horrible. is I only know one out of the three. And then the other two I'm 25% on, basically. And that sucks. That's not good. That's not good at all. I have Moriarty and I have do not have dagger. I was thinking that was candlestick. However, my idiocy, she does not have dagger. I have Moriarty, so she definitely has conservatory. trail when I've used like my other two cards like yes he really knows like I don't know he is my biggest opponent right now because I 
don't know what he has, you know? And that's just... That, like, that, I, that's the one inside was dumb. Mm. 
I like this. I like this. I like this. I knew it was the wrench. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it was mustard wrench from the beginning. I've just been trying to narrow down the freaking rooms. I should have made a final accusation. I'm gonna lose this whole thing because I didn't have the freaking cojones to make a final accusation on ballroom, billiard room, warp study. That was a smart play because we know exactly what freaking. So this tells you everything right here because see what I'm saying? There's four and then that person has to have that. So they probably, I mean, they can't have more kids, but. Look, you can see her like her full legs. Like, this is a see through dress. She's a little scandalous, Scarlet.
dining room. Well, <laughs> gonna get no information from this. One last final look at this. She's pretty. Okay, now at least I know it's not this person, this weapon, and two rounds. So that's actually pretty good. That's a pretty good lead. Conservatory. But see how I. She had a low roll, so like if I didn't bring her in there, she could potentially not even get into a room. <gasps> not helpful. Oh my god. Bring them into a room, give them this mercy, and what do they do? Give me no information. that peacock has one out of them. But the other one really could be it. No! My card! Showing for the umpteenth time! Oh my god, people. How many people need to know it is not Irene Alder? Four! Four of us know that. I guessed because I wanted to show you guys the character card and get the next person in the room with me. 
everybody else took my idea. <laughs> they were like, you, you know what's a good idea? I'll ask about the same person over and over and over again. <laughs> Eventually, we'll all know the same information. <laughs> I swear, if somebody else asks about her, I'm gonna be so frustrated. Notice how the one person who has the card didn't ask about her. Like, oh my god. The lounge? Oh my god. I'm gonna guess about the revolver next, though. A different person with the revolver. And then see if it mixes out. Maybe I should ask about Plum. I don't know. Peacock. Dagger. Here's my dagger. Take my knife with my heart. Thank you for not asking about her, though. There's other beautiful ladies around here. Like, Ask about plum and the revolver. Interesting. Well, and now we're down to four. So if she asks anything about plum, I, at least I know that it's not the first it's revealing not plum.
packages. for a murder. A murder. replies before I have to. I don't like to give away information. Chicken burgers.
Okay. The library. No one's going in there. I see. I can make the assumption that this person. WTF? Oh my god. I need to know about the revolver! replied and it's not an orchid that's not dagged so he has conservatory what's that gaining information left and right i'm gonna hit continue and i'm gonna mark this off <laughs> left and right information that's helpful No 
what's going on here. Oh, I have no information. That's why I really look at like people's numbers before I make a, a, a guess because I want to avoid So. 
this is kind of helpful if it passes the group one. It's, it's no added information to me. Like, I know she has four kids. I also knew that those people didn't have five kids. And Hoth, like, eh. But, like, that's the thing is we all knew that they didn't have Piper Hall. So then if they did ask something, then I would automatically know it was Orchid. And I just, eh. or what but two 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 so yes scarlet which we knew or we practically knew so we knew it's we know it's either peacock or mustard a way i could guess is i could guess no i gotta just guess peacock I really think it's the revolver, unless this freaking middle person has the revolver. It could be wrench too. Or rope. Uh -uh. Pipe, revolver, rope, wrench. We know it's between peacock and mustard. That's literally it. Well, I have a dining room. I'm sorry, I, it, it does it gives it, it puts me on a timer, which stresses me out. But I know it's Peacock. But I know 
he doesn't have the rope. One there with an X. One there with an X. So that that's good. Let's review this, guys. One here with an X. We don't know about this. We don't know about this. Okay. We don't know. Two. 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 So that's the two. Three. 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 But we know that's the three. But then we have a four. Four. That's the four. got x so we know it's mustard so knowing it's mustard it's this person doesn't have mustard so and there's an x here so that means that they have the revolver so now we're on to pipe or rope i would say it's rope peacock rope library but i don't think it's gonna get to me but we know he has the hall
yesterday. I'll ask about this white with the rope. Give it to me. Oh, well, now I have three ribs marked off. Six more to go.
why are we obsessing over this old thing? Pop the champagne. is getting a quite a few X's on his chart. Oh my goodness, my cat is sleeping underneath me at my feet. Wrapped himself in my blanket. Please don't ask the same thing. I have the dagger. That's not helpful. Come here, 
you boy, I ran into the nurse and let me just, you know, yank you up onto the ceiling. with this many people having a potential to have the ballroom. Conservatory. Well, you're not gonna get the ballroom. you want but you shall receive the conservatory ask what you want but you shall receive the conservatory between ballroom and rope. She could also have the ballroom. This is why I'm not going to the ballroom. That is all the information I got. Is that Plum does not have rope. Diamond. Ah, that's mine. Why? Unfortunately, we already have ones on both those spots, so we'll try to figure that out. If you guessed about one and the thing, it wouldn't help. It looks like 
works like one of those like really overly friendly old guys. You know, the ones that are like just a little too friendly. information of Monday. None at all. It's very not helpful. that figured it out. Well, she could be showing her wrench too, but I figured out the peacock. So now we're down to white or gray. And we're down to candlestick, lead pipe, rope, or wrench, and probably just build your room hall lounge. So we're actually down pretty far. However, that's so frustrating. This will definitely tell us. I think it is the hall. Come on. Uh, 
clue game. Every single clue game. Okay, one more. Is that what I said last time? One more. I don't, I don't think that we were, I, I figured out after my turn that we were that close, but like, I wasn't that close, hold on. So we're 
not going into the kitchen because he knows I have the kitchen. between plum and rope. That's very clear. 50-50 between candlestick and gray. So he definitely has one of those two cards. Now, the second card is also, could be, he could have green, dagger, or library. And then the third guess, he could have green or candlestick or conservatory. So, like, simplistically, he has green, candlestick, like, uh, like, okay, basically, even if we do the most simple route that he has green, right, that means that he doesn't have conservatory. And then the dagger in the library marked off. Okay. But he has green, then, you know, he also has to have plum and rope. Or rope. Okay, so that's one of those. It's two. Then we're down to the ones. So then that's three. So his three cards are right in here. Somewhere. Green, revolver, conservatory. I really... He really could have green, or he could just not have green, and he could get the card to figure that out. So it's like, what am I supposed to do with that, you know? Well, he's gonna know every single one of my room cards. This is frustrating. Thank 
Also, the threes are now down to 50-50 between green and candlestick. I really think he has both green and candlestick. That would be very interesting. But he could also not have green, and green could be the correct um, guy, which is very interesting as well. And he's just showing off other cards besides. So, like, he's showing off candlestick when he, and <gasps> that. Not I! Scarlet with the candlestick in the oh, it is not I. Awesome. Oh, I need to. It's not me. Uh, cause she has rock candlestick and she, there's an X on candlestick and I have billiard room, so it's scarlet. That's actually helpful. Now I have no two people, one weapon, and four rooms. Bava, the ballroom. Well, now we know that Plum is down to a 50 50 between Orchid and Ballroom. See, now we're using her weapon to get us a 50 50, which is nice. mysterious cards. Interesting, right? But now we're down to a 50-50 between the plum and ballroom. It was a 50-50 between plum and rope, and now we're 50-50 between plum and ballroom. He's really trying to narrow down the other two. In that case, maybe he has gray and green, but I, I think he stumbled upon knowing that it was green, and now he's just keep asking about it because I don't think he could also not have gray, and he could have candlestick, and so he doesn't have a person to guess with to hide the fact that it's green and he doesn't need information about the other people cards because he knows who it is so now he's trying to get other information but 
potentially. Oh, you're asking about the conservatory. How interesting. Please go on. Please continue. So she has something between Ray and Candace. I have like one dot under everybody now. <laughs> That's funny. I know eight cards. Highly suspicious that it is green. I feel like I'm just gonna ask about it. And if he shows it to me, that's great. Like, I have somebody else marked down, you know? Oh, 
my Scarlet with the dark eye. Like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you so much.